or a kitty cat country, depending on what you prefer. Um, so I'm just gonna, I'm gonna try to record today without any, um, headphones. Um, and I'm gonna see what the sound quality, quality is like. Yesterday I watched the video that I recorded yesterday and the sound was very low. So I'm gonna try it without the headphones and see how it ends up turning out. But anyways, <clears throat> Um, and whichever sounds louder, whichever sounds the loudest, that's what I'm going to start doing, you know, from now on. So today what I'm going to do is just a quick face when, you know, it's the morning time. This is what I do in the, the mornings when I go to work and on days where I'm actually pretty tired today, I slept for like 10 hours and I went to go for a jog and my stamina is definitely not where it was before even though I just took, I took two weeks off basically. Um, I ran last week but, uh, I ran twice last week but really it's the gym that helps my stamina for me and I haven't been going for three weeks. So running, I took a break two weeks and gym, I haven't gone in three weeks. So... Anyways, definitely need to go to the gym tomorrow after work. So right now what I'm going to do is a quick face because I'm tired and my back hurts. Um, after I'm done streaming, right, after I'm done streaming, I'm just going to like lay on my bed, like on my back and then just rest for a minute, close my eyes. Um probably burn some incense because that makes me feel good and maybe play some Pokemon I want to go get my nails either removed or changed out because one of them is starting to lift um, what I'm putting on my face is this Tatcha thing it's a silk canvas primer and the reason why I like it is because it has skincare benefits and when it comes to my complexion products I try to stick with things that have skincare benefits um, not just like straight up hardcore makeup you know because um, I think I might have mentioned it before like I am very consistent with my skincare in the mornings and at night so I feel, and maybe I'm wrong, but in my head, I feel like if I have these hardcore complexion products sitting on my face for more than eight hours, which is usually the case if I wear makeup on a work day, um, then I feel like it's undoing all the fucking work that I put in, in my skincare regimen investment, you know? So what I just used right there is this pixie thing. I think I talked about it before. A game changer. I don't think I'll ever go back to... And like, it's not that I'll go back to expensive concealers. I don't think it really matters. As long as it's clean, I like it. But... Like, I, I, I went through a period where I was just buying concealers because none of them seemed to work on me. Like, they looked too cakey, and then I fixed that. You know, I, I fixed it by actually prepping my under eyes and, like, because I think I might have not been moisturizing my under eyes the way I should have been. And now that I fixed that, I have more prominent dark circles, and... I went to buying concealers again and nothing was working like it had the full coverage you know like it, it covered up the majority like maybe 80% of my dark circles but my under eyes started looking like reptile skin so yeah um, so definitely the color corrector is a game changer so now what I'm gonna do is I'm going to prep my eyelids with this Sigma What's it called? Eyeshadow Base Primer in the shade Ignite. Um, 
as I'm doing this, it's like so reminiscent of like the old school YouTube videos that I used to watch back in the day. I still like watching them, but when it comes to like, you know, get ready with me videos, I like to watch makeup, make me up Missa because I really enjoy her accent. She's Scottish. I dig that. Um, I have so many eyeshadow products. I have so much eyeshadow. Sometimes it can get a little overwhelming. So I'm just going to go simple. Like I've had this eyeshadow palette for I want to say like four years. It's a blush and highlighter palette with eyeshadow in it. And it still smells like chocolate. Um, there was a girl on YouTube. Um, her videos are still up, but she doesn't post regularly anymore. And I, I really enjoyed her, her videos. Her name is Whitney Simmons. And, uh, Okay, this eye look is definitely not something that I normally do. But I'm extremely tired. Um, I liked her videos. Their, uh, her content was more like um, fitness content. You know? And I just really liked her energy. And she inspired me to start working out at that time, which was like in 2017. And in 2017, I wasn't like overweight, but I was, I didn't have conditioning or I don't know, that, that's the word in Spanish. I didn't have definition, I think is what you're, how you say it in English. Um, and so what I ended up doing, I was like, yeah, let, let's work out. And I started feeling great. At that point I was like 160 pounds which was, it, it's fine. And I really enjoyed how I felt, which was the most important part. Um, this is just a Rare Beauty cream or liquid blush called Encourage. I really enjoyed the way that I felt. I didn't feel like I needed to lose weight or anything, but it just came naturally while I was working out, you know? And so, yeah, but that was a long time ago and then I met my husband and we both like had a fondness for food and we were just in a really happy place, I think. And that showed, you know what they call, they call it like happy weight or whatever. And I ended up gaining was like 30 let me see I was like I dropped down to 155 and I went all the way up to 198 pounds yeah that's a lot that's like a small child that's an elementary skit elementary elementary kid that I gained so definitely ended up being in like a bad spot mentally. I was not happy with myself. I was very disappointed in myself and it just all happened so fast. I felt like when, and actually like, I felt like it all did happen really fast. Like, I don't know how the fuck I gained weight so fast. Because I want to say like when COVID hit, I was like, um, that's when I was almost 190. You know, and that's like, so I gained weight in like two, three years, all that weight. So anyways, I'm glad to say that I'm happy to report that since I've changed my eating habits, I have lost, I'm 180, 181 right now. So I lost 18 pounds. And I, I plan on losing a little more because... I think I've mentioned it before, like, because I like working out, having less weight means less stress on my joints. I could be, I feel like it is. 
stressful on my joints. It's interesting because when I'm done jogging, my knees are hot. Every, every other place is like cool, but my knees feel hot after I'm done working out. Very weird, right? So I know it's not in my head. I know it's not. And this is just uh, the brow glue. Be very, use this sparingly because like as it dries, it gets flaky. So I just do that. And then I'm gonna curl my lashes. Sorry for all the, I have a lot of makeup, dude. Probably not as much as like a beauty influencer, but I do have a lot of makeup. But anyways, um, I'm so looking forward to my bed right now. Ugh, I really just want to lay down. Like, and I was making a TikTok and usually, you know, like streaming and making TikToks usually gives me energy, like it motivates me, it gets my mind racing, but today I'm just fucking tired, you know? I think it's going to be really cool when I watch these, because I plan on watching these um, next year, which is literally around the corner, y'all. And I'm very curious to see if my content is executed differently or if maybe I can identify what my style is, but at this point I feel like it's a very... Uh, video journal style you know like you guys are literally my diary I feel like for this month uh, I could feel oh no I think I'm gonna have to take an allergy pill <laughs> my nose is getting super fucking itchy yeah so I'm just using the bye bye panda eyes Mascara, it's like four dollars. It's super fucking cool. And I'm putting on mascara and I'm twisting, twisting my wand as I spread out the stuff. Eric J S J S J S Rusa. I don't know what that is. <sighs> So I have this guy, all right? So this guy makes your skin look so nice. So I'm gonna get a little bit of this and then kind of mix it with this and put it on here. It makes your skin look so nice. I like it. See, like it's not glittery it just looks, I don't know, like shimmery maybe? Glowy, glowy but not glittery. It kind of reminds me of the hourglass powders. So anyways, as I was telling you before, this palette right here is a Tarte palette. And man, Tarte has some really good eyeshadow. And the cool thing about Tarte is that during the holidays they're always having sales and they have like eyeshadow bundle sales their blushes are bomb they're so nice like i just if i didn't have the makeup collection that i have right now i think i would just i think i would go ham a little on those tart eyeshadow palettes but i really just cannot afford to buy more eyeshadow palettes because of space man i have so much like i opened up my area where I keep my eyeshadow palettes and my mom saw <laughs> and she was like oh, are all those eyeshadow palettes like is that all eyeshadow palettes I'm like yeah mom and she was like that's a lot and I'm like mom it could be worse like it could be drugs and she was like you don't have to say stuff like that and I don't know it was the thing my mom's weird like that she worries about the strangest things sometimes all right, so the last thing I'm gonna do is put on a little setting spray only because I need to use it. It's like really cute. 
And the last thing I'm going to do is put on a little bit of lip oil. I'm just going to use the Lime Crime Wet Cherry. Yeah, so the cool thing about that Tatcha Silk Primer is that it blurs out your pores. And my awesome acne, acne scars left like divots in my skin that make it look like the surface of the moon. All right, so that's literally all I do in the mornings. Like aside from the eyeshadow, cause usually I use two colors, but look at this. This is, this is all I do. Oh, the color just changed on the camera. But I just put, like usually I don't do cream. Usually I do powder for a blush, but you know, and uh, the second color for eyeshadow, but literally like this is, this is how I go to work. Maybe lipstick's a different color, but that's it. That This is my face. Yeah. So now what I'm going to do is, oh, I love that green in my hair. I think I'm just going to put some dry shampoo in my hair because it's almost time for it to wash. And my awesome blowout, it's going to go away. But um, I'm going to do that. And that's pretty much it. I hope you enjoyed this installment of Vlogmas. If you'd like to see me get done up, like on, like as if I'm going on a date with my husband or going to a concert or anything, like if I'm going somewhere and it's a special occasion, let me know. I would love to do that because I haven't done that in a while. So I think that would make me very happy. So let me know if that's something that you'd like to watch and I'll do that for you. So until next time, Take care of yourself. Take care of each other. Bye.